How's it going? Hope you're having a great day. The boys and I are just behind our campground taking pictures and video whatnot at golden hour and uh, just really enjoy these times. Uh, but we stopped at this little Passport America RV park and it was just gonna be a spot in between where we were heading north to McKinleyville. Um, we were impressed with the area so much that we had to stay a couple extra nights to be able to see a few things around here. I mean, like the Avenue of the Giants, who does not wanna see some of the biggest redwoods in the area? So we went and checked out the, uh, the Avenue of the Giants. of a tree. This here behind me is one of the very early RVs. It's made out of one full piece of redwood. It's an entire log from the, the ceiling to the walls to the floor. It's all one intact piece of redwood that was whittled down by hand to become this vehicle. It has everything from a kitchenette, uh, a fold up lavatory, a toilet, uh, drawers, a uh, fold down bed, uh, electric lights and running water. This thing is crazy. I thought we just had to show it to you. Two feet long, about uh, 12 feet in diameter. Only goes 12 miles an hour, but pretty cool. Go across the street, so I'm assuming it's this nature trail. Okay. We're gonna see a redwood. Like a big, um, like that big, big, big that redwood. Big. That one is huge. People at this park must be some of the nicest park owners we've ever met. So they uh, told us, you know, we said we were gonna go check out the Avenue of the Giants and they're like, you have to go check out the section of the Lost Coast over in Shelter Cove, I think it was called. Um, so we took the drive. It was a crazy, crazy windy road, but well worth it. 
So we just pulled into the lighthouse and uh, needless to say, we're taking just a moment to catch our breath because that road in was one doozy of a road. It uh, was windy. What else? Bumpy, lots of potholes. Fast. And extremely steep. The incline and the decline on that thing, the, the grades were out of control. I asked Chris just a minute ago, on your scale of one to 10, where is your adventure scale right now? And she gave it a... Two. <laughs> Just a two. <laughs> the road wore her out. But this area does not look like it's gonna disappoint. It looks pretty stinking cool. So and flat. <laughs> <laughs> flat. And flat. So we're walking along this uh, beach kind of tide pool area and we're seeing a lot of dead seals and bones and whatnot. This area we just read has a very high, large amount of uh, great white sharks. So um, people are staying out of the water. I mean, the water is very cold here, but surfers put on wetsuits and still go out. But uh, it's, it's a, a very high population of seals. And that means a high population of the great white shark. So I think we'll be staying out of the water for now. So just after we were done walking that beach down there where we were seeing the dead seals and whatnot, uh, we're in the truck eating lunch and this shark, you can see it just right over the cliffs, uh, just beyond the waves. I mean, it's a little ways out there, so it's pretty big, but you can tell it's a shark. You can see the dorsal fin and you can see its back fin, but uh, crazy that we were seeing the evidence of it and there it was right there. And now, we can, are, are those wells? They're either whales or they're very boats, but... Yeah, it's moved. That dark object's just moved a lot. Yeah, oh, wow. Because now wow. I can see it. So it was a complete false alarm on the whales. We pulled over, uh, got a closer look, and uh, yeah, it's just some boats out there. You know how you get all excited and you think you're seeing something, but... Hey, for seeing the shark, you know our rule. We get ice cream tonight. So do you. Get to go get some ice cream. We're gonna get some too. What are you doing? I got the dirt! The jar of dirt! It's a handful of dirt. Well, yeah, but it's gonna become a jar of dirt. Hopefully. Chris just informed me that her sense of adventure went from a two, it is now at an eight. We're doing good. Except yours is only at a one. <laughs> hey, cut like... that already. Cut, cut, cut! Yeah.
Well, I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as we enjoyed the area. Uh, we're gonna call that a wrap because we gotta head out of here tomorrow further up north and uh, we'll catch you next time. <laughs>